Hello everyone and welcome back to my let's play of Don't Starve. I am Bill Cosmos of Dark Edge Flight here and we're continuing our play with Wolfgang here. Yeah, Wolfgang a go go I called the first episode. So as you see we've got our, our science thing, we've got a fire pit, but we also have a very, very weak Fulton. See it's not good. He's He's not doing that great, so we're gonna see. Well, really well, really good. It's really insane. Ah, oh, I can make an extra trap. I've got nothing to bait it with. And I need spider stuff to make those. Well, let's see. There we go. It's kind of a little bit of a frustration. I can't actually record this, at least with the program that I currently have available to record with it full screen, so. Oh dear. I, I hear a bee. Bees, believe it or not, are, are problematic there. They can be very antagonistic creatures. Ah, here we go. Yeah, carrot. Let's see if we can get that rabbit. Nice. Oh, hey, there we go. Just trap. See, it's, it's the one... The one real downside with this particular character, like I had mentioned before, is that he's... He's very much a weaker character. Oops. The weakness behind this character is unfortunately that he's not, he's not really all that good at the whole, you know, huh. he, he's kind of junk at the whole not needing lots of food thing. <laughs> To, to put it in the nicest possible manner. And he needs a rather tremendous amount of food. Damn. Alright. Um Well, I'm gonna cook what I've got, but it's he is he's not really the character that I really wanted to crud. I already got another one, nice. He's not really the character I necessarily wanted to start with, because again, he's, he's a bit weak when it comes to that aspect. It's literally going to take all six of these to really help him. Even that was not enough. He's only a 105, and we've spent this entire day just trying to fill his belly. So that's that's not a good thing. So let's see. There's some. There we go. We hit that magic number, which is apparently about 105. But he's already to the scary time coming, and... So again, by the, by the time morning comes along, we're gonna be back to him not doing so well. So that's... It's a bit problematic for us. Um... That's one of the trickiest things in Don't Starve is 
the initial time before you can get a set and continual form of, of food put together for yourself. And unfortunately that is rather rapidly becoming what my biggest problem is going to be. Because of how much... Having the, the higher levels of food means to hold it. I'm struggling to even keep it that high. So. I don't know, it's definitely going to be a problem. Sniffles, I'm a little bit stuck in the day. As you see, I'm now hovering right around that one point with him, where I'm in this kind of frustrating segment here. And even with the decently short nights, I'm starting to start having some inventory issues. I haven't really been able to get to the point where I can put together any real containers for them. Chest needs support, so let's see. I don't know if I've got enough boards yet, let's find out. This will be fine. Yeah, I was only able to do one board. Or would do more. And if I can get to that point, then we'll have somewhere to stash some stuff. That'll definitely be what we have to do this next day, but probably being again. A little low on capacity, but we'll gang here. Let's see. I think we've got enough for another fire pit, so if I end up having to do a, a fire pit away from home, that could be okay. Uh, here we go, there's some hard pits. Here we go. I know I'll need feathers later, but we'll do that another time. A little more important right now that I keep his hunger somewhat useful. And again, you can plant birch nuts too. So we'll use that to plant a bunch more trees back towards our home base. So we have longer term. Wood supplies. Come on, come on. Eighteen. 
sure, just doing as many as I can, as quick as I can, just to try and really snag us some of what we need. Okay, so that's gonna max us. We'll see there. Okay, grab another carrot. So we can do 20 stacks right now. Gives us. Something to aim for here. It's kind of funny, you can do 20 stacks of wood. I should look that one around. There's a wormhole that can take us heaven only knows where. Here we are at home base. So we're gonna refine some more wood. Okay. Now with that, we can build our chest. Boom. When we open that, we'll find we have a place to source of things. So didn't mean to do that, that's, that's brilliant. There we go. So we're gonna store our nighter and our gold, because we really don't need those except for time. So we can combine those stacks, we're gonna plant our trees, and we're gonna keep enough rocks so that we can do an outlying pit. So I have to get Four more rocks, and then we can do an outlying pit, which will be useful. Now, we're going to want to get a spear together so we can start hunting good. We're going to make a coil of rope. That make ourselves a spear. There we go. Cool. So now we have a spear to make use of. Okay. Now normally I would plant a bunch of trees, but as you can see, we have almost no food. So instead, what we're going to do this time is is we're going to cook some of this up. Okay. So, we're going to plant the pine tree because we can't cook that. However, we can cook the birch nuts. So, I'm going to cook up most of them and then we're going to see if a few of them can be planted. Let's see where that gets us hooked away. to half his hunger, so that's a good start. Let's go ahead and quickly get a couple of these traps baited for tomorrow. And there we go. There we go. Alright, so now we're going to wait through this night cycle, and then see what's next. Uh, 
Alright. Oh, excuse me. Oh, I can hear those trees growing. You know what, why don't we just go ahead and cook up these last three. I'll keep it strong for the next day. And go over here. Getting somewhere. We're starting to get some things going here. Backpack. There we go. So as you see, the backpack has some extra room, so that's a good thing. Now it does mean I can't carry my armor, but that should be okay for the moment. Let's see. Well, really, this is, seems, this does seem the way to go. down those berries. Up our sanity out a little bit. Good, good. Ooh, there's some nice big trees. Oh, we found the edge of the world again. Man, Wolfgang, I'm, I'm right on the edge of survival with him right now. It's uh, a little tricky. Such a hungry guy. Way 
Wait, where was that? I heard that. The saddest turkey sound effect ever. Where are you, turkey? Oh, I'm in a, I'm in a bad way. I'm in a really bad way here. Oh, time to make a temporary camp campfire. I never did find more stones. Let's cook all the berries this time. Because remember, cooked things give a little bit more hunger back than uncooked. the best we've been with him for a while. And so as we start going into the night today, I'm going to go ahead and end our episode. So we're surviving so far. We're not really thriving, but we are surviving. So Wolfgang gets to, to stay on and have a third episode. So I, I kind of wish there was a way to like slash dance with him, but we'll just like do a, a happy little thing there. That's right, he gets to have a third day. I am Vale of of course, and this has been the second episode with Wolfgang here on Don't Starve's Let's Play. I will see you next time. As always, please like, subscribe, most of all share. It does help me grow the channel. You can find links to my social media and more pages from the Dark Edge of Light in the description section down below. I'll see you next time, and as always, game on.